Jesus my friend, this is between you and me. By this I refer to both this conversation and your ultimate decision of whether to accept me or reject me. When you are asked to make an important decision on earth, you consider your options. You take time and weigh both sides. Perhaps you waver between one course and another. I want you to consider both sides of this decision. If you accept me, you will have entry into the most loving and secure family of all. If you accept me, you will have security for the rest of your life in that I will lay out the course in front of you, guiding you, protecting you, and never leaving you. If you accept me, you will come to heaven in triumph, bringing with you the great benefits your cooperation secured for your family. You will walk in truth and income. Your life on earth will not suddenly become easy, but it will be filled with God's peace and God's grace. If you reject me, you will continue on, vulnerable to the deceit of my enemy. You will delude yourself at times, thinking you are wise. Perhaps you will feel superior to many of your brothers and sisters, but I tell you today, in all of my truth, that the most humble one in heaven holds all of God's mysteries in their soul. You will not be privy to these mystical realities if you reject me. How could you be if you did not want to be? I conclude with one of the greatest truths of all. I do not force my children to choose me. I do not force humanity to work for heaven. If I did, we would not have a family, but a master and his slaves. No. This is not for me and this is not for you. The heavenly kingdom would not be the heavenly kingdom if it were not filled with willing and beloved children. Everyone in heaven works for each other in great joy. Everyone in heaven works for our family members on earth in great hope. As you read these words, there is great hope in heaven that you will choose me, Jesus Christ, and embark upon the journey to truth. It is here for you. I have truth and I have a course laid out for you that will bring you to this destination I love you. I will take care of you. Choose me and I will begin to reveal myself to you. You will know peace, my friend. You will know security. You will know joy for all eternity. This is your inheritance and I am your God. Allow nothing to divert you from the truth that I am Jesus Christ and I love you. I come today to announce myself to you and to save you. Come. Trust me. Be with me. I will protect you. End of message.